What's going on, brother Plank? Good afternoon. Yeah, I had to put the I had to put the uh, I'm alive voice on. Uh <laughs> Beautiful. Yeah, 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 yeah. You got to fake it till you make it, baby. You know what the fuck going on. Um Of course. So hey man, today we're taking a look at 12 minutes of gameplay for Lies of P or uh, as I like to call it, the uh, Tales of Big Plank. Yes, sir. Uh, uh, yeah, man, I'm actually True very story. excited for this. I'm uh, I'm gonna stream it for you in the Discord real quick. Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you. I got you. So sorry, we would have jumped on this a little bit sooner, but you know, I had some. Well, how do I? I gotta put this differently. I <laughs> I had uh, an encounter with uh, some hot breakfast sandwich action action. So uh, you know, real hot buns to to meet type beat you know what i'm saying so, yeah, uh, yeah 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 I, I i had to i had to jump i had to jump on that first um but yeah let's go ahead and hop in the mix man um first of all let me ask you let me ask you a question as a dark souls veteran how you feeling about this <laughs> overall <laughs> listen i mean you played them all right uh yeah i haven't played demon souls mm. i think that should disqualify you true yeah, because I even played that one. So. Oh, yeah. That was. I, I mean, you're old, so yeah, 100%. Fuck you, bitch. All right. Mm. But anyway, as a uh, Dark Souls player. There you go. All right. Uh, what, what are your opinions before going into this, first of all? Um. So I've seen the Gamescom trailer. We were watching it together. So <clears throat> I saw it. I mean, I was interested. I definitely... It felt more like, not more, but it kind of felt like Revenant at some points. But it also looked like uh, Dark Souls, obviously. So I'm I'm excited for this game. I'm probably going to play it um, when it drops, to be honest, because it looks good. Mm. Game looking delicious, man. <clears throat> hey, I, might have to, yeah. I might have to gift this to you, man. You know, we're going to see. We're going to see. We're going to see how it looks. We'll discuss that when the time comes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, after this 12-minute gameplay. So, let's take a look. Oh! This bitch got multi-multiplayer. Okay. Hold on now. Right? Is that what this is? Or, no. It's just an NPC. Stuff. I don't think so. I think it's an NPC. Nah. Yeah, it does. I thought that was, I thought that was a whole homie right there. Nah, that'd be insane. Okay. It's a little faster than, uh... Elden Ring. I'd have to say. Uh... <clears throat> yeah. Oh? What? What is this? Oh. Not, not you whiffing it before you can get the stealth attack off. Okay, the parry animation is so a little strange. The block. Okay, we don't need to see the tutorial. I don't know why they're taking the time to do this. <laughs> I think it's trying to sh set up the different systems mm. uh, that that this game is going to have compared to gotcha. a Dark Souls game. Has a perfect guard, which is quite interesting. I don't know if that's like a is that supposed to be the parry or mm. Ooh, that was a that burning. That was a lot crazy. of damage. Yeah. That, that, oh, this dude getting uh, jumped. Ooh, that roll. I don't know how I feel about that roll that's animation little, being so long. Yeah, that looks a little clunky. How was this enemy not aware that he was there? You just aggroed him. Most of them, I, I don't. They're trying to. I guess they're trying to do this thing where it's kind of like Dark Souls, how they're kind of fucking dumb as shit. Mm. I guess. Oh, this trying to perfect timing guard. is terrible. Oh, I think they have they have a Sekiro style of the way he he's presenting it, or the players. Presenting it, it's like Sekiro, how the perfect guard, I don't know if you you know 
how it was. You can kind of mash the parry in Sekiro right. to get a kill. Mm -hmm. I don't know if he's doing that because the system is like that or for some mm. other reason. We'll have to see. If he can get a parry off, then, you know, we'll yeah. be able to tell. If he can get a perfect guard off. Damn. Ew. Damn. Not hitting him with the oil and the burn. Jesus Christ, man. Oh, this dude is dead. <laughs> nice. <laughs> uh. Hopefully here we'll see some of the level design as to how it's going to look. Right. Hopefully it's more like a Bloodborne kind of level design, more than like a, a traditional Dark Souls. Right, right, yeah. That's kind of what it's giving me. So it's, it's Even the art style is very Bloodborne. Like yeah, the, the Victorian, era. Yeah, Victorian yeah. era type of... Okay. So it's kind of... I, I guess this arm implant is going to be like the Sekiro one, where you had the different ability... Yeah, Damn! That's what it, the different abilities with the arm. Mm -hmm. It's like the prosthetic from Sekiro. Oh, okay, gotcha. That makes a lot of sense. Alright, are you going to get the attack off this time, or...? Oh, okay. Right. No, he changed his arm, so he doesn't have that attack anymore. He doesn't have the electric one. Okay. Oh, he tried to perfect guard. Yeah, I saw that. Alright, my boy, I'm gonna need you to heal up and uh, pretend like you've played these games before. Mmm! Mmm! Oh, that's interesting. Good shit! I'm trying to aggro him up there, so. Okay. Now, what's the purpose of him doing this? I think he's trying to take out the small guys before he gets the big guys. Ooh, uh, uh, it's not working though. Yeah, I can nah. assure you. I'm just wondering oh, why he, he might was trying die. to aggro. Yeah, he's he did. Is. Yeah, I thought so. I'm just wondering why he was trying to aggro the big guy like that. But, because that wasn't going to free up enough space for him to take out the other guys. Yeah. Not us critiquing this developer. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. He needs it. Honestly. He needs it for when the full game releases. But he's going to be in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, seriously. Okay, so it doesn't look like... Alright, can you get the... He said, fuck it, I'm not going for it. He said, I tried it twice, I don't need to do it no more. There's a guy right there, on your left. Oh, okay. He said, I'm getting the souls. Okay. Lost to Ergo. Okay. Ooh. Damn. Oh, bro. Don't don't go running through the level. Take them all. Oh my. All right. What you gonna do here? This looks like a dead end. Is that what I'm seeing? I think there's a guy behind him. Nah, I do what I got swung on. What the? Oh yeah, there is a guy back there. He's up the stairs though. Hmm, all right. We finally made it past the beginning of this. So I'd like to see, man. Yep, yep. Second section. Here we go. All right. Oh, well, this is this pretty game's cool. looking very linear. Yeah, this game. From what we've seen, even though he's just got here, it seems like the game is going to be a little more linear than the Souls-like count. Oh, never mind. Maybe not. Okay, hold on. Let me hold my tongue. We might be doing something here. Oh. Yeah. Nice. So this must be the... Oh, oh it's a phone. Oh, wait. No. Stargazer. Okay. So that's the save point. It's the bonfire. Yeah. Somebody answer that phone, gonna, though, Yeah, man. yeah. But he gonna answer the phone? He need that. Oh, what is this? Falcon eyes. 
he's just gonna ignore the phone. All right, that's cool for, you know, might be part of the story. Oh. Oh, wow. I wonder if that does AOE damage. Damn. They gonna pack this dude up. Oh, maybe not. Oh. Damn, bro. Hmm. Who'd it be getting to play these games, man? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. We still haven't seen a perfect guard yet. Oh, okay, hold on. We're seeing some deviation. Seeing a little bit of difference. Oh. Uh oh. That's a good dodge. Oh, wow. These guys are not taking that much damage. He's going to die down here. Unless he pulls out the arm cannon. Can I see the arm can? Oh, what is that? Is it a charge attack? Yeah. Oh, Ooh. hold on. He's got combos. <clears throat> Might want to get out that corner, bud. Can I see the arm cannon? Nope. All right. Well, hey, he getting boxed up, man. They putting this dude in a ziplock. Hopefully not. I spent like three deaths in the beginning. Oh, okay. Let's see. Does that hit? Oh, he missed. Time to bomb. Wow. And he missed. He gotta be getting frustrated. All right, try it again. Yeah, here we go. Aiming on controller. He got him. He got him. It does do AOE damage. It did a good amount of damage. Yeah, not bad. Woo! Okay, okay. he takes it. He takes the win. All right. What's the reward for this? Oh, okay. You get a second weapon. Okay. All right. Interesting. Oh, these menus are weird. Oh. Nice. Okay, so you get a second. Okay, you get a second on hand. All right. All right. Good shit. Let's make it to the next area. Not gonna lie, I thought I was gonna see two more deaths. Yeah, I mean, I hopefully they put out this this gameplay without uh, without being too much death. I don't know about that one. It'd be a crazy ten minute gameplay of just him fucking cycling from the front. Uh, from the beginning to <laughs> dying. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. Saw that coming a little bit. Did not see him opening the chest being a thing he would do first, but okay. I think he's just gonna run past. Yeah. No need to fight a losing battle. You're, you're not gonna win this, bud. Those three dudes almost clapped you up in that itty bitty ass room. Okay. Is this a boss-like enemy? I don't think so. Oh, the boss enemy is in the example picture, yeah, but I don't think he's going to encounter a boss yet. I think that's oh. probably going to be where the gameplay stops, is right when he encounters a boss. I don't think they're going to have him fight the boss, because that shit probably would take forever for this guy. Okay, so that combo we saw earlier was the Fabled Arts. Mm. I, I'm assuming that's like the weapon art system from Dark Souls. Oh, okay. Oh. Wow. Okay, he's stuck. Oh, good shit. And... Oh, I didn't even do anything. Damn. So this is. Oh, I what can't the tell. What the fuck this is, is that? A... I don't know. He got the fucking Hulk hands on. Oh, he got wow. the sock and boppers. Jesus Christ. Not the sock em boppers. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Ooh. Ooh. Jesus. Hey, you can forget about this, bud. Oh, he took he took mad chip damage from blocking yeah, he that. Did. Oh my god. Then he got he's, flattened. He's done. he's done. He staggered that early? 
That was fast. You might want to heal, bud. Oh, that's yeah, it. I so. Yeah, I figured. Wow, I figured well. that was a short gameplay. It didn't feel long. Uh, you know, it was twelve minutes, and um, six and a half of it was dying. <laughs> um, yeah, you know what? Mm. This game in in the hands of somebody that actually knows how to play this game, I could see it being so great to watch, but everything else is just kind of. <laughs> It's, I mean, it's what I expected it to be, you know, it's very Bloodborne, Soulsy, like, you know what I mean? So, yeah, yeah. I mean, that's what this, this one seemed very linear from just the gameplay we saw alone. Like just the map design was super linear. Like you saw, he didn't really venture off. And I, I'm assuming that the area before the, the door, before the factory to the right that he didn't go to, I believe that might've been like a dead end or there couldn't have been much there mm, right they, he didn't really explore it yeah there wasn't really a whole lot of like looking left looking right looking around you know so you know what i mean so yeah. maybe the way he's this this person is playing was very linear mm -hmm. um but i mean just from that it's, it's hard to tell but it looks like the game might be you know what i mean you walk through fight a couple bosses and then that's it yeah it's gonna be a lot more linear than I would have liked, um, but hey, you know. I mean, yeah, that, that's only twelve minutes of the game, so it's hard yeah, to tell. Exactly, and then it's not even a fantastic twelve minutes. I mean, no shade to the guy playing or. Person yeah, playing it or wasn't like, like uh, oh my god, I saw everything in this. I saw a good amount in this twelve minutes. It was like. I, I would have liked to see a perfect guard or a parry. I I would have liked to see. That. Yeah, it would have been nice. So you know, I want to see what that animation is like. I mean, he tried. Yeah, tried. yeah, yeah. A couple of... <laughs> struggled really. I don't know about tried. <laughs> hey. So, um, yeah, man, this is definitely looking dope. I hope they put out some more gameplay soon. Um, I would like to see somebody that actually can uh show us more of the actual like fighting portions of the game or the exploration. Uh, cuz I remember when we got the first Elden Ring uh gameplay it was like 10 minutes or so, and it was exploration-based, you know, but obviously, you know, Elden Ring is, is more open world. Way like, bigger. Way, way bigger, bigger of a game. Way bigger of a budget, yeah, probably. So. Um, but I would have liked to see that exploration, if not, like, how good the combos and stuff are and how cool the animations are. That would have been really dope to see, because I think... When it comes to Souls games, that's something that really does stand out is uh, the animations and, like, the, uh, what is it? Uh, the executions that you can do and things like that. Oh, yeah. Those kind of make the game. Like, Sekiro is probably one of my favorites because you'll have, like, some of these really cool ones where you jump on top of somebody's skull and then slide your sword through their head and all sorts of crazy stuff. So, I always like seeing that stuff. So, not seeing any of that in here was kind of kind of a bummer kind of a letdown yeah like like you said it's only the first 12 minutes it's really not going to give us a whole lot of information but uh is it a buy more than likely Ooh, yeah I, I, I mean for the me the thing is from this gameplay i couldn't I, if it's 60 i can't reasonably say that this game is worth 60 dollars so far mm -hmm. but i mean maybe if down the line we get more gameplay and it Proves itself more, definitely. But right now, it's looking like, a, hey, I might have to skip this one. Even though it looks nice, I might, depending on what they show in the coming months, it might be a, a miss for me. Just because recently they dropped Dicium, uh, a different studio, and it was a Dark Souls like game. And I was, to me, it was a, a disappointment watching it. Really? Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Okay. But I mean, Hopefully this game is a little little bit more in depth, a little bit more interesting. Interesting. Okay, well I'm gonna have to look into that one. Uh I think for me, this game is definitely a pick it up 30, 40 bucks. This is falling back into, hey, you thought you had a good Souls game with Elden Ring. You enjoyed that game, bought it full price, super fun, you know, dope, made you go back and play some of the other ones. I finally got a chance to go back and play Sekiro. Uh, not obviously not as, uh, engaging as Elden Ring, but I mean, you know, whatever, uh, still a fun experience, pretty cool. 
Um, Bloodborne, I would have to say, was definitely worth a per worth a sixty dollar purchase. Um, it's very unfortunate because this game's gonna be seventy dollars, not sixty dollars. So you said it's gonna be what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're uh, it's it's starting to look a little bit more common that games are going up that that extra ten dollars again. So uh, yeah, yeah. Remember when games were expensive when they were forty bucks? Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the future, baby. Welcome to the future. So, but this was cool. I enjoyed watching this gameplay uh, for the most part. I can't wait to see some more. Uh, I want to see some of the hideously crazy bosses. Uh, I thought that clown boss was going to get a cutscene or something like that. That would have been nice to see. Uh, but yeah. I guess when they plan, he might be a mini game. boss. Yeah, he might be a he might be a, just a regular named enemy. So we'll have to. Yeah, see that's, that's what they usually do. They eventually make the sub bosses like just regular ass enemies mm, gotcha gotcha so i already know for a fact that the next lies of p trailer is going to be a cinematic trailer i don't think they're going to show more gameplay after this i think they're probably going to show cuts of gameplay i don't think we're going to get a gameplay reveal again for a minute so, yeah yeah probably till december if i had to guess i don't I know when this game releases so some sometime in the future february Oh, uh, was it March. February? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it was February. Yeah, it's it's, it's fairly soon. So, it's uh sitting with the with Forspoken. So I was like, uh. Oh, it just, just says twenty twenty three. Oh, okay, for sure, for sure, dope. All right, well, we'll have plenty of time then. But if you guys enjoyed yeah. uh me and Plank breaking down the lies of P, let us know down in the comments section. Make sure to leave multiple comments because we gotta show the algorithm that you guys actually enjoy the content if you guys really did uh make sure to hit the like button subscribe to our channel um also if you guys missed this week's episode of the podcast we're gonna have a uh do i want to put yeah we're gonna have a clip right here uh so you guys can check that out also uh make sure to subscribe to the patreon if you guys want that extra uncut content that we have in the extended content this week's is is pretty pretty wild i would have to say <laughs> <laughs> so uh but until next time we will catch you guys later